are really excited to learn about what archaeologists do and what you can share with us about your passion for archaeology. So they're going to take some notes as we go along if there's something interesting that they want to find out more about or if they have a question that they'd like to ask you. And um, then we can tweet you after if they come up with other questions that they'd like to ask you. My name is Nick. I work at the uh, Kentucky Heritage Council, and I'm an archaeologist. And uh, I was wondering, what do you all know about archaeology so far? What do you think that we do? Ooh, okay. Yeah, I don't know if you Cindy. can tell which one I'm pointing to. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll do names. Cindy. Um, an archaeologist is a person who like digs up stuff in the ground. We can talk a little bit about um, the, the different trade systems. This would have had to go on a boat, probably to somewhere in Europe, and it was bought and sold there and shipped over to the United States and thrown into a box full of straw so it wouldn't break and made its way all the way to the middle of Kentucky in 1800. And uh, we can tell all of that by finding these things in that place. What other kind of questions do you have? Right in the middle here, in the front. Yes, you. And then go up to the computer. <laughs> Do you ever find stuff on top of the ground? Yeah, um, a lot of times we'll find things, we call them uh, uh, surface collections. And uh, whenever we walk through plowed fields um, and somebody has just dissed up the ground, sometimes there will be um, prehistoric artifacts on top. Uh, the context, so the, the location of these artifacts sometimes is a little off because if you think about it, Whenever they are um, plowing, they might drag artifacts along with them a little ways. So we have to take those and um, we have to be cautious when we find things on the surface. But in other areas of the world, like um, out in the West or out in, uh, say, the Middle East, around Egypt in that area, where you just have desert, um, a lot of archaeologists are starting to do aerial archaeology. You can fly over, you can take pictures, and sometimes you can see ruins and stuff that are right on top of the surface, which is very cool. 